wait for you to wake him up. What's your excuse? What's your excuse boy? You can't get a good night's sleep. This guy's sleeping on one of the busiest roads in the world. This road, Sook and Bitten Bank Hotman, never sleeps. He's got people going to the ATM all around him. He don't give a fuck. He's going, I'm getting some sleep. I'm getting some rest. I don't give a fuck about anything else. That's a great attitude to have, isn't it? Just, I'm going to get my sleep. I'm going to get my rest no matter fucking what. Nothing's going to disturb me like this guy. So the guy in the street, the most people say, oh, he's scum or whatever. Hey, he's getting better sleep or better rest than you is. He's got a better mentality when it comes to sleep and rest. He'll fucking sleep anywhere. So he's getting his rest. So thumbs up to that guy. I'm going to learn a lesson from that, for sure. I'm motivated and inspired by people from all walks of life. It's just little details you've got to look out for with an attitude of gratitude. Get your rest. Get your sleep. I'm off to bed right now. So the take-home message is don't let anything get in the way of getting a good night's rest or sleep. Even if it's a megalodon shark trying to nip your legs off, don't let it get to you. Do anything to get your rest and sleep. Change your focus. You need every night sufficient rest and sleep. And if you get yourself all wired up and jacked up, negative attitude, you're going to spike your cortisol, become, become a fat storer versus a fat burner. So you want to have a positive attitude no matter what when it comes to getting that rest and sleep anywhere.